What is going on, all you beautiful souls? Reaper here, and welcome to a no new series. Oh my goodness, Aegis. Anyways, this is a new series. I want to get to the top of this tower. This will be replacing Enig Dang it. Enigmatica 2. So, the reason we're not going to be doing... I need blocks. The reason we're not going to be doing Enigmatica 2 anymore is... Lobster has lost interest in the series. I didn't want to keep making him do something he wasn't interested in. And... Honestly, it is the first modded thing that he's done since he's come back to Minecraft. And so... It was a bad idea for... To, I don't know how to get up at this tower. I'm just gonna... I know there's something at the top of it. But I have to get away from the... Aegis. So, this is Craft to Exile. Uh, according to the mod pack developer, it is supposed to be similar to... Diablo 2. I have not played that game. Perhaps I will. I know it's a popular game, but I've never personally played it. Come to think of it, I don't think I've seen anyone play it. Okay, let's go ahead. And, oh yeah, this is quest based for some reason. And no matter what you do, no matter what you do, you always spawn in a village. And since you spawn in a village, you always get the loud Aegis. I'm going to find out what's in the, oh, that's quite tall. I don't have Optifine or anything installed right now, so I can't even zoom in like I typically would. What I'm also going to have to do, is that a rock? That's a rock. So, I keep getting distracted by the big tower. So, this is a mine and slash. Uh, mod pack. It's all centered around mine and slash. Which presumably turns Minecraft into a hack and slash adventure. Yeah, go somewhere else. So I'm gonna go into a house and claim this quest. I also set a respawn point. I'm also going to take a sip of my drink. Uh, give me a second. That's much better. Okay, so. Let's get our newbie gear. And... Oh, hey. That's not supposed to happen. And that gives us some good energy regen. Also, we're in 1.15, so we have bees. So that's cool. Got an Aegis that looks like a potato. Can I break this? I can. Oh my goodness, I am so bad at ladder. Watch me make it. I 
I would also like to point out that if I fall, I just die. There is no... Maybe I'll survive. That's about as lenient as this is going to get. Oh, I made it. I've got to get all the way back down. Eh? I came up here for a waystone. Was not worth it. I should have jumped. But I got the waystone. Okay, so. Craft of Exile. Hold on. Basically a roguelike... And we get spell points and skill points. We get spell points and whatever. And we... I keep going to the wrong thing. Um... Okay, that means I can... Okay, so I need... to work on a base. Also, I would like to point out that even though we are stopping Itamaka 2... I, we will still be doing some multiplayer. I plan on doing it in a roguelike adventures and dungeons mod pack server. And that way, it should let us be a little bit more relaxed in the playthrough. Because I'll admit, we were both super stressed the entire time we were doing the Enigmatica playthrough. I was having a good time, but that's because 90% of my life is stress. So I'm, I'm used to stress, unfortunately. Why are these so tall? Oh, that's because they're not spruce. So I think what I'm going to do... For a, um, the next episode. I am going... Why are they glowing? Did they get hit by a wisp? There's a wisp. Lip. Oh, wow. Oh, I didn't want to do that. Um, so this mod pack has Lycanite's mobs installed, if you couldn't tell. Ooh. It also has serene seasons. I need to sleep. 
Oh, hold on. You get to listen to the beautiful sound of me sleeping. Slurping, I mean. Since I need to stay near the village. So I can fortify it, I believe. I need to take another chest. What is this building? Oh, it's a stable. I think this is from 114. So this right here is our bounty board. We have a lot of wind in my ears. Y'all might not even be able to hear it. Sandstone, terracotta, emerald, bricks. I don't know what the decrees do. If anyone can tell me. I'd be really appreciative. I need to get stone. Or... Iron. All I need to do... Is make a pickaxe. And get a few iron. I don't want to mine that coal too much. Because a Geonaut can spawn. Anymore. I need to get the coal to smelt stuff, but I also can't deal with the geo knock right now. If you've never played anything with lichenites mobs, geo knocks are terrifying. 90% of the time, they are the worst thing that can happen while you're mining. Because they spawn from ores. And they just hate you. Okay, let's make our furnace. Can I? How long range? Oh, that's how it works. What is that? Is that a Yeti? It's a Yeti. So I think off camera I'm going to deal with, what's the word, the house. Because as most people know by now, I go underground most of the time. Okay, now. Um, I'm going to pause the episode to get back up to the tower. So I'll be back in a second. So, I got all the way back up here. You, in this mod pack, you can't break the waystones. 
So I'm going to jump back down. And hope that I'm not going to die from hitting the water. Oh, hey, Maka. An Ari sore. Do I already have knowledge of the... Yeah, I do. So, from what I've seen, the only goal in this mod pack is to beat, I'm assuming, bosses. And get through everything. But there's also... Immersive Engineering... Sorry, I had to yawn and went ahead and got a sip of my drink again. So, I don't know what the next quest is. I've already forgot. Oh yeah, I need to kill two skeletons. Or... Okay, so I think that's where I'm going to end this episode, but I do hope you guys enjoy. If you want to see more, let me know. If you want to see us do another mod pack at some point, let, us, let me know down in the comments of one of the videos, and I'll see what I can do. But for now, guys, that's it. I might even fix up the village a little bit off camera since I'm going to be here a lot. I'm also going to install or excavation if I can. I don't know if it's out for 15.2 yet. I know it's out for 14 whatever. So, I'll see you in the next one. Bye-bye.